Community Television. You're watching West Hartford Community Television. You're watching West Hartford Community Television. You're watching West Hartford Community Television. For the community, by the community. Welcome, everybody. Welcome. Thank you for joining us again to the Mom's Time Out. Um, it's been a great end of the season. We had a little bit of snow holding us back and kind of scared about when spring was coming. Exactly. There's still I snow know, on the ground snow. and it's April. I know. Right. Mounds of it. All I'm done. I'm we done have tulips, so we're okay. Right. Tulips These are, are out. beautiful spring, spring tulips. Spring here. Yep. We're trying to make spring it Spring is home. sprung. <laughs> yes. yes. Countdown to the end of the school year is on too. We've got a couple months left of that. Oh, I know. I'm not ready. Right. Right. Yeah. We're not going to yeah. even to go there right now. No. April that's vacation. That's the well, most. that's, yeah, exactly. we can talk about that. That's coming up really soon. Yeah. Anybody? Some I'm going to the Bahamas. All of us are going to the Bahamas. We're going to the Bahamas. I'm going nowhere. Well, well, you, you just, just came back. back. Yeah. But I was working. No, I was working. We saw the pictures. She wasn't working. Pictures, I was working, working a little bit. I was working. Yeah, yeah. It was an event. We had yeah. to do it. And Andrew, are you going anywhere? Yeah, we are going to Orlando. We're taking That's the girls awesome. to Orlando. That's amazing. Disney? Yeah. We'll do like yes. Disney one day, yeah. but they're older now, so li I could just gonna, stay at the resort. You know, I could just pool. stay there in the pool with the cocktail with a nice little. Mommy's drinking. Yeah, well, every kind of like, every, as long as my drinks have a little umbrella in them, and I'm the good. Gonna You're good to go. Bring them to yes, you. I'm good. I need a book and that little drink. Lori, are you going oh, yeah. anywhere? I'm not. I feel like we should go to like a hotel and just put an umbrella in our drink. Oh, <laughs> let's do it. Let's at least do it. at home. Please, please, I need it. But you're, are you done looking at coffee? DJ Mario. Oh, oh, we forgot DJ Mario. Mario. Are you feeling better? <laughs> yes. You've been a little sick. You've been no, a little sicky poo. I was on a, with a fluid. Two weeks on a flu. Okay, oh, but you're better. Are you, are you doing anything? I mean, you've been working overtime, my God. <laughs> yeah, I got a lot of things to do, but um, yeah, I, I am going to Portugal this year. Oh, nice. 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 And then nice. later on, I'm going to Brazil. Oh, so the life. Are you taking your daughter to both trips? Yes. So it's oh, nice. That's great. It's amazing. It'll be the first time for my wife and daughter to, to go to, to Portugal. 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 Yes. Portugal. So will you stay with family, do a little bit of sightseeing, or? Uh, it's yes. Oh, yes, yes, and yes. <laughs> I, I imagine you can't go there and not see family. Right. No, they'd be so yeah, mad. I still got a lot of you cannot do that. My dad, I mean, actually, my parents are doing a, a festival. Like a, it's a ritual. Like, like a reunion. Are you going to DJ it? Yeah, well, I know you DJ in Brazil. It. I'm serious. He does. Yeah. He goes to Brazil. I've seen yeah, him DJ in Brazil. Do, uh, I usually do like a big concert over there. Yeah, yeah, he does. Yeah. Huge. Yeah. That sounds so mm -hmm. fun. Is it in Rio? No. It's south of Sao Paulo. Oh, oh, I love talking about all these warm places. Yeah, <laughs> no, I know. This is as warm as I'm going to get for a while. Seriously, <laughs> haven't even put my puffy coat away yet. Nope. Like, it's either. been a little crazy. But Easter is also coming up, too. Yeah, yes. that's right. That's yeah. a big holiday yeah, I love, in I our love family. Yeah. And it, a lot of the families, it's a big holiday. Yep, it is. I mean, yeah. it's... Oh. oh, what's up? Oh, Maury, it's your favorite time, time of the show. show. Time for our favorite thing. <laughs> You this know is what? I'm not gonna, favorite part of this is my favorite part. Really I get so excited about this, but I'm not going to do the first one. Oh, you're going to oh, give oh. us the first one. I'm going to pass it oh, off. Oh, Adrian, now. do you want to go first? Sure, yeah. yeah. So, go. my favorite thing, they're actually going to put it up on the screen because I'm wearing it, is it's a Be Brave bracelet that is in honor of my daughter, who is a um, congenital heart survivor, a cataract survivor. She has glaucoma. But, but my favorite thing is the company behind this. So, it's called Bravelets, B R A V E L E T S dot com. And what I love is that they partner with any nonprofit and they help you fundraise for your charity. So if you go to bravelets.com, you can link up your charity. They help you create a page. You pick the color. So like Gabriella picked red. I love it. But, you know, we bought one for my aunt who's been going through breast cancer um, so she can be brave. My sister's going to buy one for her daughter so her daughter can be brave. I mean, it doesn't oh, have to nice. be an honor, but it's kind of a nice yeah, um, message that, that it gives. Yeah, yeah it is. And they give 10% back to the charity. That's great. So I thought oh, that was wow. a, just, nice. it's a really nice thing. And it's not 
very. It and doesn't. You can pick your colors of the band. You can. So we picked red, what right? Are some of the other so colors? there's yellow, there's okay. orange, but like Francesca. Ha so there's a bunch of different yeah. jewelry too. It's not just bracelets. So oh, Francesca okay. has be brave earrings. Gabriella has a beautiful be brave um, bar that. necklace, and like rose gold, nice. right? Yeah, really pretty. You should and put it, that info up on right our on uh, Facebook scar. page if people wanna. Yeah. Yes. Did you get it? I did. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Thank you. So that's wonderful. Oh, I like that. Well, my uh, favorite thing for this month is a an app. It's called Ooh. Waze, and it's both oh. for smartphones. Oh, I don't know this one. And for droids. <laughs> so it is a it's a GPS function. Oh, I can't. But I instead of, of having of this. just a map function, it's kind of a um, people have to participate in it, and okay. it's all over the world. Um, the reason I like it is Wait, because what's it called? Waze. Waze. W A Z E. Okay. It's a free app. You can download okay. it for free, um, and it's. Not just a GPS system because, again, it's uh, kind of like a people participate in it while you're driving around. What do you mean they participate? They so yell like, "Watch out!" No. Nope. So, <laughs> so you would you get your ways up. It posts things like in real time. So if there's a police oh. stop somewhere, yep. it says police stop and it indicates where. I do have that. You it's awesome. awesome. It's awesome. Oh. If so they like have construction or something. Construction. Oh. If there's traffic. Yep. If there's, there's a car in the something shoulder. in the middle of the road, debris in the road, mm -hmm. something in the middle of the in the shoulder. Skunk of the road. crossing. Anything like that. Anything. Yeah. So people yeah. report it. And then Please. when you report it, of that. you get points. So you get points added to your account and it kind of just makes you like in a tier of membership. Um, it's really points. Yeah. Yes. Really what do you get? Yeah. It's like you win for nothing. They oh, kind of nice. create this little thing for like it's the like gamers. It's like an award for everybody. You. Right. Yeah, exactly. It's, cool. it's really, really oh. neat. It's almost it sounds like this. Yelp, and but the not newest for... thing is just on Tuesday, I think they launched something where for Dunkin' Donuts. If you go into Dunkin' Donuts, you have your um, Waze app. You have to be. You have to have the Dunkin' Donuts app, and you also have to have yourself registered with their rewards or whatever. So okay. you can now. Like Starbucks, yeah. you can go in and you can pre-order at Dunkin' Donuts mm -hmm. through your yeah, ways. Yeah. Right. So you don't have I'll to like open ways. it separately. Lori's yep. like, I'm all over that. Oh, God. So yeah, yeah. ways is great. She's the pre-order queen. Not just GPS. Queen. I know, so I am, but do I, do like, I do like Dunkin'. Okay. Do you I'm use sorry. your ways every day? No, I just oh. use it when we're going anywhere where I don't know where I'm going. Just for GPS purposes. Okay. okay. Interesting. Yeah. Okay, so we ready for mine? Yes. Okay. All right, so I'm going to have you guys try this. Oh, boy. I love when we have food. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I know. So this is a healthy food. food. It's, um, it's kind of mimics the paleo diet. And oh, so right. it's, it's granola, but it's called paleonola because there is literally wow. no grain. There's no oats. It's gluten-free, non-GMO. Mm, that sounds so delicious. <laughs> I'm telling you, it has a little no grains. A little tiny bit of honey. It's vegan um, because some vegans don't consider honey um, to be you know, a problem. Mm -hmm. No grains, gluten-free, no oats, no fillers. Um, it's made right in Rhode Island. Um, it's a little bit, you know, a little bit pricey for my taste, but... And you can buy it at regular stores. You can buy it at, you know, regular stores, Amazon, health I'm stores, sure. yes. But you have to try it. It's delicious. The shelf life, of course, is not huge. So why did no you do that? Why do you have so this instead of granola? It's just healthier? Um, it's healthier. There's less carbohydrates. And you can put that um, in It fills you up. It has, like, nuts and coconut. Yes. Yes. Oh, yeah, it's sure delicious. Really good Come, here. Come here. Give this particular hand. one has a little bit of maple in it because it is um, called a maple. So what is it? Vegan. If it's not grains, it's, it's not. It's nuts. Mm -hmm. It's um, <gasps> oh, seeds. It's coconut. Oh, I see it's sunflower seed in there. Yes. Making a little bit of a mess. And it's cinnamon. Good. It's very so good. I highly recommend right. that they have different flavors. This one's maple. Actually, my nutritionist turned me on. Oh, to this. it is good. very good. So I knew it's it had good, to yeah. be good. <laughs> so it's really I tried good. it, and it's actually really delicious. I like yeah. it's maple pancake. Yes, so they, have different, they have different ones. It goes good with my wine. It'll go good with the <laughs> maple it'll, it'll syrup with your red wine. With my favorite thing. Oh, okay, Lori. What is that? We could all take a step after. <laughs> um, I'm sorry, my life. You've been sick. No, I'm Lately, not. I feel like I have to be hydrating more often, so I've infused my water. I've been infusing it. And put any of your berries in there lemons, strawberries, blueberries, and my new little favorite water bottle. So that's like an infuser water bottle. No. No, she doesn't no, infuse Oh, this is a water bottle. I just infuse the fruit in oh. the water, and it's easier to drink. I could drink like three of these a day. As like you're supposed to drink, like, yeah. You're right. to drink like half of your body ounces, weight, I think, yeah. 64 ounces a day. And so it makes it possible if it's kind of sweeter. Nice. And, but I heard you could do cucumber, sea, lemon, mm -hmm. seagrass, and anything else that you want to put in your water. So, yeah. Oh, that's so that's using not the water bottle, but infusing it with fruit. Because right, right. it makes it infusing easier for it you yes. to get your water. To drink as much so, as how many now do you drink of those a day? Like three. I could drink up more, probably. Because I'm at like work. It. When I'm home, I don't drink. If I'm at work, you drink. It's just them. easier, yeah. 
I find so. I'm always running to the ladies room though if I'm like yeah that happens. I try but to you get your water. water. I you have to get five your, of those. You have to get your water in. But yeah. And do you keep the fruit in there and just keep refilling it? Yeah, all day. It? Like all day, and I refill it. Nice. Do you eat the fruit at the end? No, because it tastes <laughs> awful. <laughs> Like the but warm yeah. and tequila. I mean, um, <laughs> so it's kind of like exactly. having a spa on the go because you know yeah. when we go to the spa, uh, they have work. the cucumber. Yeah. Now I'll just have to get that granola. And yep, paleonola. Paleonola. Mm -hmm. I like that. That was very good. That yes. was very good. Yes. And but can I ask you a question about that? You said that honey is not considered. Some the vegans consider it not to be that they can because have it. it comes from a bumblebee. I'm, but there oh. is oh. nuts in there though. We're getting There's the nuts. wave. I think we need to. Um, Move yes. on. Move on, but we're going to be back. We're going to rearrange our set. We're going to be right back with a fabulous guest Amazing. who's going to Very tell us and share with us how we can be her. more mindful. So cheers. 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 So welcome. Welcome, Kim. Welcome, Kim. <laughs> um, we're so excited to have you, Kim. Kim is a mother, wife, and owner of Mindfulness and Matters, the first of its kind meditation studio right here in West Hartford. Um, Kim has been living with stage four metastatic breast cancer. She has undergone 60 plus operations, um, has done numerous rounds of chemotherapy and medication over the course of the last 18 years. Um, Kim is a one of the, the best survivors I know. She's very involved in our community, community events, um, nonprofits. We had her come speak. Um, I was on the Committee of the American Cancer Society. We had you come speak. You did a phenomenal job. And you are just one of a kind. We are blessed to have you here. And we can't wait to hear all about, um, to share with everybody about your studio. Thank you. Welcome, Kim. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you. Um, thank you. Well, we, and we should actually tell everybody I think we're going to put a picture up on the screen. We took a Mindfulness 101 class. Yes. Is that what it's called? That's Mindful. correct. Yeah. Right. So what is Mindfulness 101? Can you explain what that is? Mindfulness uh, meditation is just really learning to be with your breath, um, learning to or helping your brain to stop looking forward or looking backwards and just being, which is, it sounds very simple. But that's why they call it a practice mm -hmm. because it's not. It's so not, being in the moment, yeah, correct. Being mindful of the mm -hmm. present, right now, right what you're feeling, where what you're, you're feeling. thinking, exactly. And that, again, it sounds very, very simple, but it's a very difficult thing to do um, because our minds have been programmed to be doing so much so many times right. you know on different levels we're multitasking all the time always especially and moms I mean I feel like mm -hmm. uh, of course and to take that our biggest muscle and just let it relax just a little bit mm. um, <laughs> can do wonderful things mm. and wonderful things to healing in the body too absolutely mindfulness um, just being able to uh, meditate and be be quiet for a few minutes. It lowers our blood pressure. Um, it helps with anxiety, mm -hmm. depression. They've shown uh, with elderly, uh, with loneliness, it actually helps them deal with that. And, and coming from a place where I was an athlete before my cancer. Um, what did you do? What was your sport? What was your? Running. You were a runner? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Marathon runner. Okay. Wow. And, and so you had a lot of practice already being in your mind for those long periods of time. Absolutely. And, and having that taken away, I was like, what am I going to do now? Mm. What am I? Because that was my stress relief. You know, that right. was, that's. Kind of like eating for me. Just <laughs> <laughs> running. Well, it, everybody has a way. Right. And <laughs> to learn to cope and or to have a place to just settle down. Um, that's where my mindfulness practice began. And so you weren't doing this before you no. were diagnosed with breast cancer? No, I learned this after. Um, Over the, it's been the past 10 years you've been <coughs> practicing. Correct. Um, I was uh, practicing my own and then I started uh, at, at a church yep, yep. And, and then um, took the dive for my own studio. And your studio is beautiful. 
Right it on New Park Avenue. So as you walk in, it's just, yeah. you can, yep. you, the smells, like yeah. you just described. I love shopping. Yep. The water sound that you <laughs> have. Yep. It's very um, serene. The, even the shawls that you put around. Absolutely. I don't know what you call the and what are the puffs that we had our feet oh, on? Zafus. The Zafus. Zafus. It was very, it was good for us, I think, to do a mindfulness class to see what. It was my first meditation class, and I really loved it. But you're right when you say that it takes practice, because when you're sitting there and you have the time to kind of just sit, and relax. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You do kind of find yourself, okay, what do I have to do with it's after so hard, this? Right. What do I have to do tomorrow? What am I going to mm -hmm. do? And it's and, so and hard to can, just take that and all And that away. can almost bring anxiety on itself right. to try to settle, settle your brain. Um, that can almost induce anxiety. So, you know, with a mindfulness 101, like you. That was nice. Right. There's music. There's a little right. bit of water. The there's, smell. but then oh, there's, there's your voice too. too. Yes, keeping us in the moment. Because you did that for us. I mean, right. we sat there and just we couldn't quiet. do it by ourselves. Oh. Really. We wouldn't be able. To we kind of there. followed your voice into right. the silence and then and you the eventually stillness. get there because the first couple mm -hmm. minutes you are thinking that way, right. and right. then after, okay, you're starting to right. really zone out and and, and think of your mind and exactly it's really, and really they're really practicing awesome. this more in um with with the youth too absolutely i was so excited um doing the youth on um uh, sunday nights uh the teens and tweens um just yeah. to have them come in and put the test away and you know yeah, right. and and uh, oh, everything and and just learn to breathe and put down the phones I get think away from the screens and Kim you really think that this is what you told us this is how you got through a lot of what you were going through this helped you get through it all. I I went to mindful mindfulness meditation because I was dealing with pain um, with cancer and knowing treatments were ahead of me and learning how to just be with things, um, it helped me immensely, yes. Now, so you That's still great. have pain, but you're able to cope. Right? I think you said, yeah. like, be with the pain. You said something like you're able to live with it. She, like, she recognizes it, but yeah. you're able to. Absolutely. Um, just being able to uh, go through uh, a procedure and breathe through it and sit with it and not let the anxiety get a hold um, has just helped me immensely and that's what I hope I am you know able to do with other people and you help um, share your story too through your blog right you have a yes, blog I do. It's 17, 17 years, years of pink, pink. pink. <laughs> yes. yeah and well it's, it's 18 years of pink now yeah. oh exactly. yeah yeah, yeah. Yes. and yes. I read a little bit of it I read some of your blog your blogs, and it talks about not just your journey through all of this, but your family's journey. Yes. You've got two children. I do. And a um, husband. Yep. Um, both of my children now are in, at college age, and they have lived this journey uh, with me, and they, I have learned um, through them just to see how mindfulness also can benefit them. Right. And oh, sure, because I'm sure they were anxious and. Right, they had their anxiety for <laughs> you as well as for mm -hmm. them, Correct. all of it. So I'm sure that was Correct. Yeah. greatly helpful for everybody. Yes. Because they were going through it. I mean, they were right along with her. Young. Yes. Yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, I was pregnant with my son yeah. when I was oh. first diagnosed, yes. Wow. Right. So and just for, for people who don't know, what is <laughs> metastatic cancer? Metastatic cancer is when it leaves the original place and travels breast through the breast. body and mine has gone from breast to um, lymph nodes to now lungs and um, I'm terminally ill and so mindfulness meditation is just the way I have learned to live with this disease mm -hmm. and to uh, help others and um, it's, I, I really feel I'm blessed that I can share this with others. And who are the people, Kim, that come to take a class with you? Like, would you say that they're like, they've never done this before, they're a little nervous, or they've done meditation before, or is it just runs the gamut? Are they mostly most women? People, are most they? people now <laughs> at the studio, um, they're, they're new. They're new to meditation. They want to know 
what am I supposed to do? I close my eyes and, mm -hmm. and <laughs> um, just, just, just like you. you yeah, just like you work. We didn't know what we're doing. But then I also have, I work with um, people dealing with disease um, and just chronic illness mm -hmm. and or just mothers that want some quiet time and uh, so it's just it's been a blessing to me to be able to offer that. Now you That's do a get blessing men to everybody. There, right? Men do go to your classes too. Absolutely. <laughs> yes, I have men. Yes. I have one man that man that should go to your class. <laughs> <laughs> but what I find my husband comes but he comes and I say, "Don't fall asleep. You want to fall awake." Yeah, you know, yeah you want, right. right. You, you did mention that in our class, right. yes, yeah. which is true because your body naturally, once it shuts down, it's like, "Oh, good, Calming. I get to go to sleep." Correct. But Correct. we don't want to do that. No, no, no. We're we're trying to really fall awake into our. I like that. Sense. Fall awake. Fall awake. Yes. So, Kim, can you talk a little bit about? You mentioned your logo, which we mm -hmm. already put we put up on mm -hmm. the screen. Mm -hmm. Mindfulness Adorable. matter. Mm -hmm. It's a it's a. Dragon? Dragonfly. Yeah. And that symbolizes the dragonflies? The dragonfly has two sets of wings, um, and the second set of wings are when I feel uh, our departed come and sit angels fly on those right. second set of wings. Mm -hmm. and I love that. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah. It's calming and it's yeah. reassuring, and I think. And so the and second part, oh, go ahead. And unbelievably, when we were doing the studio, there was a dragonfly that just stayed in the parking lot. Oh um, my gosh! The, there that were just a couple other like, people. Oh, that, yeah. you know, it he was it was really amazing. Wow! wow. So, so I was gonna cool. I was going to ask you the second part of your it's called mindfulness and matters. matters. Yes. What's the matters part? The matters part is also uh, just a lovely boutique um, of oils my and favorite. soaps, pottery, and, yeah, and she pottery. sells great Dutera. stuff. To Tara at her when yeah. uh, <laughs> I'm so happy for yes. Tara. Yes. Yeah, yes. Is it so? It's local artisans. That five. I have five artisans that have their uh, wares in my studio, and I am just so honored and blessed to have them there. And you had the beautiful bowls and the cups, right? With yeah. the uh, inspirational David Wilson. words in them yes. from David Wilson. David, Those yep. were beautiful. Wilson. It just felt like yes. the whole space was just calming. I mean, right. As soon as not you walk just in. the music, you know? not just the lighting, but it just felt right. the energy was very. <sighs> There's no like screaming. How did you find such a lovely yeah. space? Yes. I I only found that space because I was there for another pla Blaze and Bloom. Blaze and Bloom. Our okay. lady friend. Our we yeah. 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 show. And um, I was I, I was a local, you know, always coming there. And one day I popped in with my husband and to show him Blaze and Bloom. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, I love this space. I love 485 New Park Ave. Yeah, it's and got some neat things in it. And I walk. I said, I, I need, I want space here. And it was a, the space that I had was completely a uh, doctor's office, you know, wow. type, you know, yeah, cubicles yeah. and different energy. Uh, absolutely. So yeah. we took everything apart so and. Beginning. And it just has Beautiful. become this wonderful it. spot. Now, what are your hours at the studio? The studio is open um, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Um, and uh, I have a website, mindfulnessmatters.com. Mm -hmm. We'll put that which, up. Yes. Yeah, that'll yep. be on our, yep. on our Facebook page. But what can we say to people that want to tr want to try it, but they're kind of fearful? Or they what, think what, what, what are like three things they'll get out of it if they're not there for, let's say, you know, pain management, but they're there more for, oh, what can we tell them? To, to come in, just to give yourself a, a relaxation. Right. Um, or, as I was, I was I was a, a runner, and this is the way now I let my mind relax some. So to come in and enjoy um, just some soothing time, um, learn what meditation is about. I think there's a big, uh, a diversity there that we do people really know what meditation right. is right. and mm -hmm. to explain that and and to learn and to feel very comfortable and and enjoy just a little bit of me time yeah well, well enough congratulations of because yes. I know it's we only been it. up and running since last July Yes. Yeah. So it's almost yes. a year. Yes. So it's um, a little no. bit more than six months. Congratulations. Thank you. That nice. must be exciting for you. It is. It is. And you picked a good area too, because it's just starting to 
It's yeah, popping. Yeah, yes, it now yeah. the food trucks and yeah. you know. <laughs> the brewery. <parade. laughs> the brewery. <parade. laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. well, maybe yeah. you know what? I mean, we'll come back and we'll bring our husbands <laughs> and we'll oh, bring yeah. our friends. Do we I have to pre-register too? Do we have to register nope. in advance? It's it's a, they drop that's, in. That's so that's lovely, the, Kim. You're so nice. <laughs> that's the. Yeah. That's my whole thing. Is it's a drop-in type uh, boutique mm -hmm. that right. you right. can come and. There's no registration. It's it's uh, just to come. We and loved it. Great. We did. We did love we it. Did. Thank you again. So and we have a little gift for you. We do have a gift for you. This helps we us for you. Uh, and this yes. comes <laughs> us. <laughs> this is for our me time also. No. <laughs> it's our signature red wine, so yes. we have yes. to share. Thank you so, so much. Thank you. Thank, thank you so much, Tim. Yeah. Yeah. And you're thank very you. inspirational. We're so happy very to have you here. Mario's playing so island music. Great. He's like ready, ready to just go getting away. Like, yeah. Ooh, you know, I already better. feel calmer talking to Kim. Isn't she wonderful? Oh, she she is. She like, has that calming voice. Yeah. yeah. She's like the epitome. We talked about your bravery, your be brave bracelet. Yeah. She's like the epitome of bravery. Right. Yeah, she is. Oh, oh she is so, so inspirational. One of the most phenomenal women I think I, yeah. I know. I'm serious when I said we want to take one of her classes. We are going to do it. Well, you we know did. What? We did. Yes, but we're going to take another one. We should. Yeah, we're going to do more. I really enjoyed it. And I actually told my girls about it. and they are intrigued and want to yeah. try it. See, right? that was great. Yeah. Well, we're so excited for this wonderful um, launch of our show because next month is actually our one year yeah. anniversary, which I can't oh believe yeah. we made it. We made it. One year. One year. Mario, it's our one year. Yeah, one year. And I feel like we should oh, we should extend Mario. our shows like Time to an hour. Flies. We have so much to say. <laughs> oh, so much to say. I don't know. Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> We're gonna our viewers our slash husbands and kids. Well, we're going to have to do our little yes. weekend yes. getaway yes. Yes. to celebrate yeah. in June, hopefully. Yes. Yeah. Yes. You know, we're going to have a party, mm -hmm. um, a fundraiser for West Hartford Community Television, yeah, and it's going to be a great party. It's going to be in the sure center. Stay tuned for those yes. details. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But we hope everybody has a great April. Um, happy Passover, happy Easter, Easter. Mm -hmm. happy spring break. Yes. Happy spring. And Enjoy for, the nice and weather. Look for us. To be continued, top secret stuff going on oh, in town yeah, with, with the moms. Oh, yes, we're yes. going to have a lot of fun. We'll around. Around. So we've been asking some things. Yeah. So. so don't forget, everybody. You guys put, put the, the time, time in. in. Don't, don't forget, forget to take the time out. out. Cheers. Cheers. Dun, 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 dun. Cheers, Mario. No, you're not drinking. Mario. Oh, good. Here's your wine. What's the place where you go every night and you snuggle up real tight? Is it in front of your screen? Where everything we show is exactly how it seems. Everything we show is right for you. Everything we show is true, true, true. So get your drink and give us a wink. Cause what you're watching is mom's time out.